decolonizedsports.com. We're here with head coach Mark Burnham, uh, Haudenosaunee, 7-5 over England, uh, a little tighter than the last time you played them, like 14-3 in pool play. Yeah. Um, just your overall thoughts on the game. I mean, it's a great game. The boys battled back. They got up on them a little bit. And, uh, you know, at the end, their excitement was uh, obviously from uh, that stick check they, uh, they pulled on the end. Uh, I think we were down three. Six, six to three on that. Yeah. Uh, Dougie, Dougie uh, Paul sticks his stick out and makes a great uh, one-hander, and the ball goes out of bounds. And uh, you know you couldn't get. I mean, England hats off to them. They they did step up their game. And they played really well. I was going to ask you what what they do different. They do anything different that you saw today from I, from the first. I, well, game? they 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 zoned up on defense. You know, for the most part, and they went man. I think the second half or you know a bit of it and. Um, I think it, in the beginning it got us to uh, pass the ball a bit more, and you know, and you got to take care of the ball when you're in, against a zone because most of your shots are going to come off of uh, backdoor cuts or you know, um, outside shots. Yeah, and then tournament time, you could just tell the intensity was up a little yeah, bit. Yeah. Um, how did your team feel coming into this one? I think uh, I think the team itself, we felt the same. I mean, you know, when you play those tight games or a late game the next day, you know, you you, you play. A little bit tentative, but I think for the most part the boys played like they normally do. I just we just got to limit the turnovers. Yeah, and then Gregory Gregory Elijah Brown five goals, a hat trick just in the first half alone. Yep. Um, talk about his performance. Um, I mean, Greg's a great player. Obviously, today was his day. He played well, and uh, he was open on the inside off a of little slip picks, and uh, you know we wanted to do that early, but we we didn't get the chance to. But today, Greg obviously had the guy who we found he was sliding from. And I said, whatever guy is uh, sliding, we're going to get you open. And uh, that's what he did. And on the backside, Greg, Greg seemed to be the guy that was open on uh, you know, most of those cuts because his guy was going early. Cool. And then last question, Team USA tomorrow in the finals. Uh, you just got done, but um, you know, what's, what's the plans and preparation for tomorrow? Got to beat the beast. You know, it's, uh, it's going to be fun. Uh, they've, we've never, well, we beat them in U19 you know, in Finland. So, I mean, anything's possible uh, last time the boys beat them. And, um, you know, it's, we're going to have to have a hell of a performance. I think we're going to have some ball control, you know, and, and if we can get that, slow the ball down. Our guys, as you know, want to play that 30-second shot clock, yeah. and as soon as they get out there, we're screaming to hold the ball, and they're just, you know, it's like pulling back a racehorse, you know, yeah. and uh, if they can do that tomorrow, I think we'll, um, you know, we'll, we'll have a better chance, obviously, if we have a little bit more control. Cool. Well, excitement's a good thing to have, so. Uh, Absolutely, yeah. and they're and they're exciting, and this game was the, uh, Again, it lived up to its, uh, its expectation of being a really yeah. good game. Cool. Thank you so much again yeah, for your time. Absolutely. Appreciate tomorrow. you guys, man.